Tyne at Z. This is Reggie, if you still remember. Yeah, <laughs> um, I know it's been a while. Um, I've been working on some new technology lately, and um, I just remembered once before in TAFE that you were one of those uh, students who always were enthusiastic about making videos. And um, you once told me that videos didn't have that much application in web design since uh, when you film something it's supposed to have to go through flash and it's not interactive well actually I found some new codes and technologies that would make it possible for videos to be included in websites so I'm just gonna show you a little demo that I made this one so this is just, re just, just video off the internet and um, it's actually uh, interactive, so I'll just refresh it. So it starts off uh, as a simple page um, with the menus, uh, menu buttons, and you know. So obviously, it's uh, it's selling cars. So uh, the video of the cars can uh, you can jump through the videos of the cars that it's selling by clicking on the icons, on the emblems um, so now Honda takes you to Honda Civic uh, there are also two buttons below which can also help you shuttle through the video so there's an, uh, the next button, so the next car in the showcase and the next button in the showcase and the, another next car in the showcase and you also have a previous car in the showcase so you can uh, you can also navigate through the uh, time rail so makes it easier to see through all the cars if you don't want to watch everything and another feature of this is every time you click on the frame of the car video it shows you additional f uh, information about the car presented so this is a McLaren and you can see the uh, McLaren dealership and the map over here and there's uh, more information about McLaren uh, just a few uh, strokes downwards so you can scroll down and you can scroll up again and uh, you can resume the video if you like um, you can so it, it's basically integrating a video into a website so this is not flash so actually this can work in smaller screens like uh, tablets um, I've so far been able to test this on a tablet and you can even manage to make it as small as a, a normal iPhone or a, you know the, even the sm smaller phones that have 320 pixels with okay that's one um, I'll, I, I've put the uh, links to these uh, videos below uh, on, on the, the uh, I've put the links uh, to these uh, sites over here at the bottom of your screen so you should be able to see it somewhere there are three links there so another one would be this uh, it's a real life insurance ad you've probably seen it before so this one is also interactive um, you can click on the text and it will tell you about more about what he's saying like what's a quick phone quote and uh, what does it mean when they say you don't have to have application forms? You know, stuff like that. Everything he has, uh, well, all the text you can instantly know about just with a single click. So in this one too, this is for a Beyond Blue. I've uh, managed to put this together from the present videos. Again, this is not Flash. So... Um, it also has clickable areas like you want to know who who this person is somewhere in the video there'll be only from tubes rather than from there'll be almost as if the yeah there it is yeah there'll be something that's there'll be a frame a clickable item that says his name and then you instantly know who he really is because he doesn't really say who he is in the video so instead of just meeting you know some anonymous person on video you, you get to know who this person really is and then you can watch it again and at the same time you can watch another video here and you can scroll to the time rail as before so it, my point is um, 
your uh, filming skills or your filming enthousi- enthusiasm for filming doesn't have to be confined to uh, i mean out, uh, doesn't have to be excluded from from websites yeah the, uh, this doesn't require any adobe software or you know at the, at the least it would just require somebody who likes filming on a mobile phone and um somebody who has something to say with video and again since it works on um smaller screens uh since it works on smaller screens you can view the same thing on For the first four months. um really? well, that's a nice on tablets so uh, the only reason why i uh uh thought of talking to you was maybe you have you still have those clients that you know you you want to show them something with your own videos on it you know uh, maybe your the people you volunteer for can use video in their websites so yeah i'm willing to offer my uh, help to make those videos um functional in uh, in in a uh, in a web page they don't have to be simply sta- uh, i mean the, the videos don't just simply have to be something you watch there's something you can interact with yep um yeah i just thought of uh, i just remembered because i'm trying to be an advocate for uh, i'm trying to be an advocate for uh, uh online uh video i i want video to be more prevalent in many web pages uh, it's i i uh i think it's a good idea that we uh that video moves ahead uh and starts being a part of a web page instead of just being uh what they call this an option that you have to look at so like beyond blue is basically when you look at beyond blue there's nothing here there's no video here so but actually um uh, curiously enough beyond blue has this website for men it's called men men man therapy and man therapy actually has started using video as a uh, a very uh, important part of the website okay so yeah uh, if you take a look at man therapy first thing that greets you is a video which is actually more attractive than something that greets you like this first time you open it that's it uh, I, I'm gonna have to talk to a lot more people about putting more videos into their sites but you know I just thought of you because you you you, uh, you uh, I, I was reminded of your uh, um, your enthusiasm for uh, for uh, capturing video so why not I mean why not make it part of something that you're already working on okay I hope uh, I hope you give your feedback somehow or you know you can get in touch uh, i hope your family's doing well hope the kids are doing well anyway <laughs> oh, cheers <laughs> don't take too much of your time bye